Right guys, got a video for you here. I think you'll find it of interest. This video will show you how to actually rank and make sales with Amazon in niches that most people run away from and why you shouldn't run away from competitive niches. I'm going to walk you through it. This is also like a part two of a video I did yesterday. You'll find it on YouTube um, about, I'll just give you the title. The title of the video was how to know what Amazon niches sell and do it the right way. And this is sort of a part two. The reason I'm doing this video is you will find a link below going through to this page. This is a special offer I did for a no lose Amazon site builder offer. I'm not going to talk about it here. If you're interested in it, there's a 27 minute video. But in a nutshell, it is a no lose offer, uh, a 100 page Amazon site. The problem is, because it's so much work, it's sold out really, really fast. Um, I only had, initially I had three spots for this. They went really, really quick. I opened up one more. That went really, really quick and loads of people emailed saying they wanted to get on. Um, so I opened it up one more time for a fifth spot and it went within 10 minutes. Um, so what I've decided to do is, because all the spots have been taken, um, I've put a little button here if you're interested watch this video obviously if you don't know what I'm talking about the links underneath this video if you're watching on Facebook you'll find the link somewhere in the box um, and I wanted to do a video that will give you some really really good information so if you didn't manage to get on this time for the no lose site builder offer um, don't worry I've put a button below so you can click that and you can get on the waiting list I will open this again because there was so much interest in it, I'm going to open it at the discounted price one more time. But it won't be for it won't be in the immediate future. But what I want to do is give you some stuff that will really, really help you. So this is the thing that you want to do if you want to see what the offer was about. If you want to see why it's no lose and why I can guarantee it, um, check out the video. And then if it's of interest, enter your name and email here, and I will send you some awesome stuff. Um, some really really good stuff like what I'm about to tell you I wanted to do another video and give you some really cool stuff and this video will tell you how you can rank for competitive niches and the right way of doing it to make sure that you have an Amazon site that one makes sales for you two is worth money if you decide to sell it and let's get right into it to back this up I'm actually going to show you as looking on flipper I love looking on flipper because what better proof that I've shown the gaming chair um, an example site I did have shown gaming chair sales and rankings and so on but it's all fair and well me showing it you know when you go to flipper you can see an Amazon site here selling for eighteen thousand five hundred dollars set up exactly the way I recommend um, you can see another one here that's a new listing uh, it's making two hundred and twenty two dollars per month from Amazon and I was just looking and I, I want to give you something that will really, really help you. When you're building Amazon sites, the key is not going away from the competition particularly. The key initially is making sure that you have some keywords that you can rank for that make sense to go after. And I know that's sort of a bit vague, so let me explain. Apart from targeting the products first, which I recommend you do, and apart from targeting the different makes and models, which I recommend you do, the other thing that you want to target that I don't see many people do, and the ones that do make a lot of money, is intent. And what I mean by that is what are they going to use the food processor for? And if we have a look on SEO book, just for an example, um, you've got best food processor and like food processor keywords and all the different makes and so on but you can see here a sub niche is best baby food processor now there's people typing that in that are specifically looking to use it for baby food and if you then build your site and you target those phrases as if you want half long tail they're not like proper long tail um, but look at that, there's only 7,110 results for best food processor for baby food. And then once you get an idea 
like what's out there you'll find if you type it into in quotes you'll find the top competing websites and you'll also be able to see um, websites there I've just clicked on one let's see if it loads okay and it loaded up and you can see here this is really really great so again like the reverse engineering thing I showed you you can actually get um, and look at a site and, and target a specific area not only can you see I don't mean copy their article but you can get an idea of how they've set it up what they're talking about and so on but you can also see the other key phrases that they're targeting for best blender for traveling and you can also back it up by typing it in so you spell traveling here we go best blender for traveling best travel blender for smoothies okay so I'm gonna try here we go okay so SEO book unfortunately with the Google AdWord keyword tool it does create problems in looking for base keywords because it's not the, the AdWords keyword tool was fantastic but they've changed it but you could see lots of ideas commercial food processor was there definitely look So you could target just commercial food presses, uh, food processes with 52 daily searches. You'll find that those searches are higher as well. Um, I think this tool, see, it's good for an idea, but I think it's a bit conservative in its. Um, but cheap juicer, twin gear juicer, different things under $100, and really, really great ideas that you can take advantage of. And that is how you can pick a niche you can find an angle on the niche you can compete with competitive niches and you can get a site out there that makes money like let's look at this one I was looking at on flipper just to give you a thing here we go top blender reviews on the market best under fifty dollars um, best affordable blenders the different makes like I, I, I suggested and these different best for ice here we go best for frozen fruit and drinks best high-end and heavy duty best cheap blender so again look um, all these ideas and all these different ways um, ice blender how to make a ice cream with a blender best blender for ice there we go best blender for crushing ice ninja blender and so on okay and you can see there that you can have content on your site that ranks that gets people that are looking for a to use it for a specific thing and um, again to prove this this one's making two hundred and twenty two dollars a month let's just have a look at the details here eighty six percent for organic search and some notable current keyword rankings um, top blenders the best blender some there um, I'm just trying to get an idea of the amount of content as well um, I can't see it but you could see you could just look at the site you know nice site all there and that is how you make money with Amazon and get some really really great ideas and look if you're interested in actually doing this once and for all if you've been following my stuff or you just want to get up and running and do do this for real do check out this video um, on this page you'll find the link below and make sure that you get on the waiting list as well because um, I probably will open it again um, at a discounted price but that will be the final time because it's a hell of a lot of work I'll, I'll let you watch the video and see everything you get but I'd love for you to be on the waiting list and I won't leave you waiting I will send you some cool stuff okay guys I'll leave the video there make sure you're on the list if of interest or at least watch the video and I'll, I'll speak to you soon cheers guys